Stay that's in um car performance mods. For cars. I don't think for tractor. I won't give you the run in the mill here, no sir. Number one. The underdrive pulley. Underdrive pulleys increase engine output by reducing horsepower they use. Many cars can have 5 to 15 horses power increased by using underdrive pulleys. Yeah. However, many underdrive pulleys can give unwanted side effects. Like horse no, no, not that, but problems with power steering and air conditioning and with the alternator. Oh no. Although there's plenty of reference to underdrive pulleys on the internet, there's, the thing is, is it's not something that's commonly mentioned for people to put onto their vehicle. So I just felt that it would be something that is not as well known that could be uncovered. Number two, you guessed it, sprint boosters. Now, my friend Nathan told me that sprint boosters didn't do anything, but that's just not true. They definitely, definitely, definitely make you think that your car's going faster. And that's good enough for me. Sprint boosters by working by telling the throttle body, hey mister, open faster. There's many of different types of sprint boosters available over the internet. And many people are happy with their effects. They definitely work. And again, it's a mod that is not well. If, uh, if you don't think that they work, you can suck my... Lastly, in third most, is weight loss. You rascal. You really could think about making your car lighter. By making your car lighter, it will go faster. Many things exist online that could help you lose weight in your vehicle, such as rear seat delete kits, lighter parts, like tubular parts. Yeah. And that is three not commonly known mods that you could possibly do to your vehicle. Yeah.